Hey, right, let's see if we have a good hair day today. If we don't, it's okay, because... Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is LaShawn and this is Lush Uncut. So today I am coming to you all with another take. But before I get into my take, I just want to say thank you for everyone that took the time out to subscribe to my channel in general. We have hit a thousand subscribers and I am very, very super excited. It happened last night right before I went to bed. And I am still a little bit in awe. I don't think it has hit me yet that I have a thousand subscribers on YouTube. So I just wanted to extend a genuine, very much heartfelt thank you for everyone that took the time out to hit that subscribe button. All the people that have been commenting on my videos, especially the one that I posted Tuesday. I got a lot of reaction for that and it has been so much fun reading the comments and replying to some, even the ones that disagree with some of the things that I said. It has been a privilege and this is a part of the reason why I started YouTube because I wanted to get my thoughts and opinions out into the realm of public discourse and be able to have conversations with everyone that agreed or disagreed with me. So thank you for that. That is the end of that. Again, thank you all. So Today on my take, we are going to be talking about this new trailer that came out about this documentary that is going to be shown on Showtime. I believe the name is Everything's Gonna Be White. This documentary has everyone kind of up in arms, understandably. I'm going to play a short 30 minute, 30 second clip of it because honestly, I don't want to show the whole thing because I don't think that it should get that much um, attention, even though I am talking about it. So that's kind of counterproductive, but whatever so here's a short little preview of the trailer itself not the documentary i think what annoys me most about white people is when they pretend like they're the victim <laughs> what's also annoying is when they you know when they kill us what is fragile about whiteness when everything has been constructed around it every part of who i am has been distorted or criminalized it's really just a bunch of White lies. <laughs> okay, so I came across this when I was scrolling on Instagram and I saw that Brandon Tatum had reacted to it and I was like, whoa, I have to see what this is about because it seems absurd. So I watched the trailer for myself and I think I had the reaction that most people have. It is ridiculously racist. It is probably one of the worst documentaries that has ever been bought or just created. It's honestly just terrible. Like, its clear message is to divide this country and people um, who want to and ba basically encourage people that want to profit off of our divide. That's not what I'm going to focus on on this video because I think those points have been repeated enough that we all know that it is trash and nothing good can honestly come out of something like that. What I want to talk about is the actual reaction to the video. Now, ironically, Showtime has turned off comments under the trailer, so I can't really show what I wanted to show. I was literally gonna go do like a screen recording of comments um to kind of prove my point but i'm una unable to do that because the comments have been turned off but before that happened before they turned the comments off when i watched the trailer yesterday i was in the comment section and a majority and of the people in the comment section basically said exactly what we all are thinking this is absolute garbage and also apparently i know youtube has turned off well youtube didn't turn off the dislike button you can't see a dislike on a video but there's some way to kind of tailor with um um, what is it called again? Like an add-on add on on Chrome or Chrome or Firefox that basically allows you to see the dislike on a YouTube video. I was going to do that, but that instructions was in the comment section, so I'm actually unable to do that. If anyone knows how to do that, then please drop it in the comment section of this video so that I can go ahead and do that so you can see the dislikes, so I should, can be able to see the dislikes with videos moving forward. Um, but anyway, back to this whole thing. The dislikes on this video, when I commented, according to the people who were able to see it, was 46,000. The video is still currently at under 2K likes, which means 46,000 people disliked that video, and that was yesterday, and less than 2,000 liked it. My point in bringing that up is we are winning, guys. Like, I know it's hard for us to kind of believe that people like us who have common sense that kind of sees the agenda that's being pushed forth to divide this country by using race um we're winning a lot of people disagree with that video they showed that in the comment section they show that in the dislikes and it really encouraged me to know that a majority of people that showed that saw this 
um, trailer thought what I thought. This is trash. So my slight encouragement to you, I guess you can say, is to speak up. We have to stop being quiet. I think we have reached a point where we can kind of passively go through life um, in regards to these things. We have to speak up so that like the powers that be know that they are losing because again we are winning everybody no matter what their skin tone is no matter what their racial or ethnic background background is agree like a majority of people that that video is trash so like don't feel like you are alone if you're like looking at something like that and be like yo is there something wrong with me like am i missing something no you're not crazy you really are not and on top of that you are a part of the majority like people we are not the minority anymore like we the silent majority is no longer silent okay so let us use our voices to speak up so yeah that is my take on that documentary i don't think anyone that well that trailer i don't think anyone that really saw that and like like looked at it that had reason and actual like general concern for our country and for what they want our country to look like saw that and was like yeah this is a really good idea like most people saw that and was like yo this is absolute trash so that's what that what that's what i took away from it it didn't make me angry because i feel like something like that nowadays like things like that are out so often there's so many books so many movies so many documentaries that profit off of the division that i don't even get shaken up about it anymore but what i did have an emotional reaction to was the comment section and seeing the amount of dislikes that you know the doc the trailer got so i left that whole experience of watching that trailer very much encouraged and just feeling like like Things are changing. The tides are changing. Things are looking up. And I want you all to be encouraged. So yeah, that is my take for today. I know it's a little different than my normal takes. But, you know, every once in a while you have to show a message of hope. Because despair is everywhere. Okay, so that is the end. That is all for today. If you enjoyed this, please feel free to subscribe to the channel. Smash that like button. Throw something in the comment section down below. And hit that notification bell. So that when I upload again, you will be notified. Thank you. Thank you for your time and your attention. Remember to be blessed and be a blessing.